And then day by day they bring me books, thousands of books. You know why your culture is so rich. And I start, I start with some uh, 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 books about fashion, about jewelry, about architecture, about textile, and so on. You know what I found? What I found? World master designs, world master techniques. Extremely, I found extremely interesting things. Jude textile. Let's talk about textile. Jude. The, the Manchester city is living only from jute textile, 100 years ago, the whole city. The, all the, the jute from India is going there for producing jute. So when I am the, the second time in India, I go to a textile, to a, a, how you say, a, a shop for, for textile, for fabrics. And I say, can you show me jute? And they show me silk. And I say, why you show me silk? I ask for jute. And I say, that is true. So the meaning is, in the last hundred years, the techniques change extremely. You know why I am so interesting for jute. I, in my research, I find out jute is one of the interesting materials. We have to fashion the jute back. Yeah? I don't know with, with the, 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 the sentence, um, help the world or help the nature, jute back not really helps. The, 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 we, we say only the people who eat grain in the morning, like the chicken, they have the, the jute bag. That is a little bit in the head of all the peoples, but it was a very good idea behind, you know? Only the design or the, 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 the way how we have done it was not, not so clever. But whatever, it was a good thing. But the jute is um, growing up without any chemical, without any poison on the gums, yeah? So this is one of the, after bamboos, one of the most interesting plants. So that is, was my idea. We have to do something with truth. Here we use PVC. You know why? We need government, uh, um, how we say, the, 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 the rule of, of, of um, um, abnormal improvement for fire protecting. We have to tailor it, um, um, artificial material, the, in, the last, uh, um, in the last six years, the India starts to work with artificial material. This you can weld, you can clean it, you can um, tailor it, you, uh, stitch it or weld it, you can glue it, you can um, 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 produce it in fire protection. The traditional material, um, um, let's say the, the, the natural tex uh, textile, that is not fireproof. You need also a lot of chemical to, to make them fireproof. But the problem is, it's extremely interesting. Uh, I don't want to explain it. Why, if you make a research about your, your, your tent material, extremely interesting. It glows, it glows the surface if it rains. So in the daytime, or if it not rain, the, the air can passing through the material. If the rain is coming, the, the material comes thicker and closed. So, extremely interesting, but this is not my target. The problem was, if I use natural material, it's not fireproof, uh, I, I cannot clean it anymore if, if, we, if we turn one piece. So that is also very dirty. Um, um, that is one uh, problem, one big problem, uh, uh, on, but we have behind five, day, five cities behind. We have a lot of thousands of kilometer transportation building up and so on. So that has happened, but uh, it worked, it still works, and it works long time. It works something like, let's say, 25, 30 years. You can repair it, you can glue it, you can clean it, and so on. So that is why we use it. We, we want to do the German rule for, for, for um, Genehmigung um, permission, yeah, for the government permission, and fire, uh, fire permission, and we want to uh, work um, um, with the Indian rule. So that is a little bit in, in, the, in the background. I'm happy that Jenny explained you a little bit about the big, uh, um, what's meaning that the German comes here and have this festival. But my idea was not we, the German, have to come to India and say, ah, oh, we are the great Germans and we show you how we can do a great show. Opposite. We come here and think, okay, what we can do together. I have the honor to say hello, good afternoon, 
to the director from the company SWIFT. SWIFT, I told you before, six years you have the knowledge in India. SWIFT is one of the leader companies uh, here in India for construction, um, for, for uh, trade, tra trade, yeah? They make the whole organization to go with the trucks to one place to the next place, uh, the workers, uh, you find the, the permission, and a lot, a lot uh, uh, um, of, of um, things we have, we have to do. So, well done. And on the, on the other side, my idea was we have to do it lightweight and we have to do it a little bit with colors. So I start now. Um, that was my idea. That is what I found in the books. Uh, I found uh, pictures from elephants. And you know, today you use the elephants uh, like in, the, in, in your tradition for holy ceremonies. Beautiful. But the elephant was for me a perfect symbol to think about, okay, we are nomads, so in the early times, very, very early, we have no fixed buildings. We have tents or simple things or uh, living in the cave. So the elephant with the small moving house, that is for me a mobile space. I show it, our team, they're looking to them, they don't understand it. They don't they think, oh, it's nice, but what, do you, what is your meaning behind it? So, but I was powerful, and I liked the picture in my, in my presentation. And then I found all the, the saddle, the saddle uh, uh, goods from, from uh, Elephant. Maybe you never have seen. I found cars, uh, um, 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 elephants with, uh, who, who, uh, with cars. I found this small, nice, uh, mobile spaces, and today, if you go to the city, you find rishkas. Often, we talked before with bamboo, that Asian think, oh, that's the poor people material. Same with rishka, yeah? Some are shame, ah, oh, we're so poor, ah, oh, we, we transporting. So, in, in many Asian cities, rishkas I have no permission to, to, to drive in the cities. Big cars, you know? The humans, the people, also in Germany, the cars always on the top, the, 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 the people who, uh, I would say the humans, have to go in the underground. They have to go on bridges or in the underground. But the cars can go on the floor, easy. Yeah? They have the power energy, but I have to go over the bridge. So how this is possible? But the Rishka is one of the most clever systems. Human energy, yeah, for free, yeah? only a little bit food, but food is like my Lampion lighting. I tell 10% translumination, you know, Electric light is not closed, so why this is not closed? No, if they switch it off, then the whole electricity... Ah, so, I'm sorry. Ah, we connect all together. Yeah, you see, so there we need only food, and then you can uh, um, work on the risk. We copy the system, and in Germany, if you go to the internet, you look Germany Rischka, you will find 1,000 companies who earn a lot of money, who drive Indian tourists, to our cities, Mr. not Indian, from all over the world. Yeah, so you see, that is a business. That is a great business. I want to inspire you. Before there was a politician, he is leaving. It's a shame. I won't talk with him. Help that your cities come car free. Buses is okay. Yeah, trains is okay. Public, public transporting and muscle energy transporting. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, it's easy, it's cheap, it's good, it makes good air. Yeah. So, and also this is a mobile space. So this is what I study. I study your designs, I study, uh, uh, I be talking about a cooling system. You see, you're, you're mostly your you're holy places, your temples, uh, um, have all, all those normal houses, uh, windows, the wind can blowing in, you have, uh, um, you have shadow, um, fantastic. And I try to copy a little bit uh, your systems. And when I copy it, I, s I start to design it. And then I think, uh, uh, I find your jewelries, and then I think, okay, Germany have to present himself here in India with the idea, with a gemstone, yeah, with gemstone. So I design my pavilion as cut it gemstone. You know, the, the, the goldsmiths cut it, the, the, the stones, and so this is why you say, oh, um, I tell you why. I think, okay, India, we read, oh, uh, so many poor people are existing in India, but I think, mm, let, don't let's talking about the poorness, let's talking about the richness. 
And if I look to your country, if I look to your, to your history, if I look what's happened here, how this country is growing up, then we can talk about richness. And I think the gemstone is a good symbol for your culture with colors, for your, for your uh, design, for, for uh, your textile. And so I start to design uh, the pavilions, I I'm, I'm, um, start to um, um, use uh, different um, gemstone designs to come on the point. And that was then my final idea. And the government accept this. They say, okay, good idea. So we try to do it. But the idea and the reality is, uh, we say, uh, two different shoes. Yeah? So it was a hard work. Uh, um, why I give a compliment to uh, Swift? You know, uh, in India, there, uh, is, if, if there's something waste somewhere, the people don't give care for this. And uh, some people uh, explain me, yeah, this has happened, then the Indians, for them only the in the house, that is holy, that is the private space. Outdoor, that's not me, that's not, I don't have to give care. So then I think, okay, we have to work on this. And that's also with the quality. I fight uh, uh, um, with, with my friend from SWIFT. Um, we fight every day for, for quality. We both standing on the top of one of the tents and crying and fighting for quality. In the end, if the media is coming with, with cameras, he takes me always on his side and he says, that makes me proud. Yeah, that makes me proud. Why? Then I think, we well understand both quality, and the Indian love the quality, and they come, and the media love it, and we have a lot, a lot of, of uh, how you say, feedback. Uh, so, and one idea was, take something new, make something absolutely new. And we, I built stable, you know, you sit on stable chairs. And I think, why we not can stable the, the, the pavilions? And also, my idea was, you see, we stable the, 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 the structures. That's ideas behind. You can do it, you don't need to do it. And also, I, my idea was, do something, a complete new tech, uh, design for pavilions. Do something with double walls. I do it a little bit faster. Do something, this is a bees house form, yeah? From the bees, from the honeybees. And I connect them. I can build a pavilion with this form, 10,000 square meter. Only small, uh, is, um, if you look behind you, only uh, uh, three small columns um, protect uh, this pavilion. And this is more than 300 uh, square meter here. So that means very stable, very lightweight, good for transportation, good for build them up, um, let's say, quick. Uh, it's more expensive to to build a pavilion like uh, like this up, but if you look the the storage pavilion or where we have the the, the where it's behind here, that's a regular tent. The regular tent's very fine. That's useful. Yeah, since hundred years the people built uh, regular tents. India have a huge tradition about tents. All the employer parties. If you look, they have hundreds of tents. The holy festival on the Ganges, short time ago. One million people there, or was it a thousand, hundred thousand of tents there. Interesting, so it's a big scene, but the, mostly the tents always looking same. 